Let's, Let's gather around the campfire and sing a campfire song. A C A M P F I R E S O N G song. And It'll if help you, with no, if you don't sing it, no, you ruined it. Go to your tent. What did you guys say? We're gonna be camping overnight. We bought two different tents. One was worth ten dollars, literally the worst tent you could possibly buy, and the other one is one thousand dollars. Jeffrey ended up pulling the short straw. So he gets the little $10 tent he's gonna be setting up first, and that means Chris and I get the big tent, the most epic and luxurious one. And we're gonna be staying in them overnight to see how comfortable and cozy they are. So let's get into the bill. What are you doing? All right. What are you doing? How'd you know I was over here? Because I saw your bright yellow sweatshirt. Oh. All right, so I'm setting up my tent. When do you better hurry? It's my tent. The basic of all basic. Four feet, six feet. You You're doing? totally gonna break it. I'm opening the package. The package? Well, it's like a tarp. It's like someone just rolled up a tarp. <laughs> Jeff, Jeff, you're in cycle Did you read the instructions? I'm twang my hoodies. All right, so we gotta. Jeff, you need to find your prime positioning. A nice spot? Yeah. Okay, so here's the tent. It's green. Presumably, these are the steakies. I'm guessing, you know, like any other tent. Are you talking about cook steak? Because I can use a cook steak for now. You have to find the attachment point. First, you wanna level out all shrubbery. So you have a nice flat surface. This actually looks like a pretty easy tent to build. Yeah, it's gonna take me five minutes. It looks like a garbage bag. Jeff, <laughs> how are you gonna fit in this tent, bro? Oh yeah, you're it over looks six. Tiny, five. dude! <laughs> <laughs> this guy right here is what, six two? Six three. Jeffrey is not gonna be able to fit in this tent. So look at this. Your, your feet are gonna be sticking out. Okay. That's not much room. Is this all it gives me? Bro, I'm not gonna lie, I'm actually comfy already. Get off my tent. Oh, I'm gonna take a nap. Dude, this claims it's a two-person tent. Dude, no way. Presumably, you stick this here. <laughs> How's this supposed to stay up, dude? You have to hold it up the whole night, that's why it's $10. Wait, how does this make sense? Uh, you have to put it in the sides and bring those out. Jeff, your steak's coming out. Guys, I got this. Doesn't really look like you got this. You guys need to leave me alone. Fine. Chris, let's go over here. Guys, we're, we're leaving him alone. Chris. Social distancing. Jeff, Jeff. Can I get a hoo yah? Hoo yah? Chris, can I get a hoo yah? Hoo yah. Insert tip of pole into upper tab. Utilize line, provide and tie one end to pole tip. Five minutes later. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. Very nice. Jeff, I picture it now. Here. Three o'clock in the morning, Jeffrey moves a little bit in his slumber and his tent collapses on him and he can't go to sleep for the rest of the night. I can tell him he's steak place. You tie it to this guy here with your basic knots. If Jeff would have let us help him, we would have been done with this tent right now. And actually, you, you're probably right. It's totally true. But this is my tent. It does not look like the picture. Yeah, it looks like he has a tumor. Well, it's good because that should give me more room with a little bit of adjusting angle. What? <laughs> what he's trying to say is he's going to have more headroom. And boom, she's done. I know how long it took you to build this simple little ten dollar tent, Jeffrey. Ten minutes and thirty eight seconds. Seventeen minutes. Oh, that's not bad. No, that's yep. terrible. But I figured it out, and I'm gonna put my stuff in there. First of all, you guys need to see my food supply, Chef Bardi, and some Incrustables, which are gonna go down yonder. It doesn't seal. Oh, it does seal. Okay, good. Hey, Jeff. I if they're called Incrustables, why do they not have crust? Ah. Take the jacket off. It's hot. You're hot. Why does it make sense to put more clothes on? Because this is light and sassy. <laughs> All right. As you guys can see, we have our blanket. We have our 10 degree sleep back for when our temperatures get real cold at night. And let's head in. It looks tiny for such a big dude. How does this even work? Hey, Jeff, you got to give them a tour. Guys, we should run away. Oh, I see. All right, guys, you figured it out. Thing. It's actually very hot in here right now. But as you can see, we're set up here. Honestly, I don't think I need an air mattress. It's pretty soft. It smells like fish in here, dude. <laughs> Why does it smell like fish? Well, my tent is complete. All right, so apparently we were from the south, so I guess I'll continue that. So this is our big tent here. We got this giant bag. Okay, I grabbed right. the, the metal poles for it. I'm already done talking to you guys. Let's check this out. This better look like the picture because one time we bought something, it didn't look like the picture, and then we're like, wow, what the heck? I feel like I'm in quarantine. <laughs> Oh, that's a virus. I'll go get the pole. So this tent is gonna be huge. So we got some rope. We've uh, got some more rope. We've got, dude, look at these stakes compared to Jeffrey's little puny cute ones. And some oh more stakes. Lord. We got enough stakes to feed an army. <laughs> Looks like a pretty good real estate here. I am gonna for our look tent. for 
for some deer to hunt this way. Hi Rob, what are you doing? Just standing around, dude, help me out. Dude, this is gonna be huge. This is gonna take a while. During the apocalypse, I brought some weapons in order to protect you guys while you set up your tent. That'll be my job, to patrol. Is that, pop, 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 I think that's pop, pop, uh, him pop, saying pop, that he's not really gonna do anything. <laughs> that's totally what he's saying. See, look at that mindless. Dude, there's a bug on me. <laughs> well, it's the, we are laying out the foundation currently. And I can say it's coming out quite nicely. So this is the center. Let's stand it up real quick. See what we're working with. This is a big tent. Construction up, pulls complete. Rob, good work. Uh, what are you, a supervisor? I'm the supervisor. Make sure you guys speed up a little bit. The customers are waiting for the video to be filmed. Cannot disappoint the customers. The video is being filmed. Do not hit your right supervisor. Now. You are my subordinate. You listen to me. I when know. I say you jump, you say how high. No. When I tell you to, to jump off a cliff, you say how far. No. When, when I tell you to jump out a plane, you say yes sir. When I tell you to shut up, you don't say anything. Okay. Good luck with this, boys. What the heck is this? Dude, This we're gonna have so much headroom with this. Money. I didn't read the instructions, but I assume start clipping the black things on. Dude, this thing is bigger than some people's houses. I don't understand how you're supposed to put the center ones on. You gotta, you gotta put the, put them in first, and then you put them in these holes. Oh yeah, you're right. Use your nog. What are we, cavemen? Yes. Yeah. Chris, does that work? You're the king of unnecessary actions. Eventually. <laughs> Got it. Yay! Look at that, dude. That this tent is like 30 times bigger than mine. You're jealous, aren't you? No, I'm happy with my little tent. <laughs> Gonna attach this A-frame here. There you go, Sonny. Hey, Chris, do you like what I call you Sonny? No. What are you, my grandpa? Get off my lawn. Dude, this is quick to build. Dude. It's only been two minutes. No, it hasn't. <laughs> On your guys' timeline, probably about three minutes or so. Come around to the back side of our tent, folks. Let me just repeat this side, same as the other side. That's good. All right, we got the uh, V-frames done. It's really hot. Okay, got hot. so this white one, there's a hook in here. A little loop right here, we gotta tie a nice fancy little knot that I like to call the, I have no idea what I'm doing knot. We have to put it approximately 10 feet away from the tent. Ugh. You, know, you do it, this is your tent. Very nice. That's pretty cool, so that little plastic covers for the rain. No yep. peeking yet, yep. we're gonna yep. give you guys a tour in a sec. We have a grand reveal of Jeff, you can't come in. But we did finish. Yes, I can. They can't. We did finally yes. finish the tent. Let's see our time. An hour. 42 minutes to build this tent. You took. I was close. Over twice as long as me. All right, but it's about 10 times bigger though. So, so what does that, that say so to you, you, Jeff? Multiply 17 times 10. That's 170 minutes, Jeff, which means we beat you. What? That makes no what? sense. <laughs> I'm going in. All right, let's, let's go ahead and give a tour of our nice, cool tent. Ooh. What you've all been waiting for! Woo! Whoa! Oh my! Dude, head inside, bro. Dude, this Dude, is huge. this is epic. What the? Guys, there's a door on the floor. There is a door on the floor. Why is there a door on the floor? <laughs> Zip it up. No, 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 no. Zip it up. So you can see nature. Wow! Maybe that's where you can put your campfire. Apparently, $1,000 is enough for the heater to be included. Really? Dude, that's, it comes with cup holders. I'm gonna go get my cot and set up. Included with this tent, we got a bunch of cool survival gear. Jeff gets nothing except for his stupid little tent. Okay, he's not stupid, Jeff. <laughs> we got some cool military cot. Ooh. Oh! What? Oh, what is that? What that the heck came that? out of your bed, dude? Out of the bed? Yeah. Dude, what is that straight from There's Africa? There's a spider. What do we do with it? What the flip? What do we do with him? Get them, get them out, get them the heck out of the tent. All right, look out, Jeff. Oh! 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 Ah! <laughs> I'm so scared of this tiny creature. Dude, he's venomous. He came from Africa. Don't brave, kill him. Brave wilderness it. I poked it. Oh, I have cardboard. It's okay, little guy. Don't, don't be afraid. Don't be afraid, little guy. He's very furry. 
He looks friendly. All right, we're gonna take him somewhere far, far away from our tent. This guy's cool, man. Let me see. Let me what see. kind of spider is that? Whoa! Dude, what's that laying on my face? I was hoping it would. What if he bit my face? What if he's venomous? I'm gonna look it up. I'm gonna go right next to the window. I can see the outside world. And I also got my cup holder. I can put my snacks in here. And I can put my iPad right here. I'm gonna close up the tent so buggies don't get in our tent and eat at our skin while we sleep. Also, we will uh, be resuming this video at night. And we'll have some more fun adventures and shenanigans and food eating and whatnot and everything you can think of. We'll see you then. It's getting dark, folks. Jeff, what are you doing? I'm cooking me up some dinner. I brought some Chef Barty. Oh, Rob, what are you doing? Oh, it's closing up the tent because bugs. Look, our cameraman has a tent too. This is his nubby tent. I'm gonna kick it. Ryan, I just kicked your tent. How do you feel about that? Is it okay? Dude, don't be rude to my friend Ryan. That's an expensive that tent. That is mean. Sorry, Ryan. Is that not a lighter? It's okay. The Ooh. ring Ooh. on fire. Ah! Guys, check it out. Man. You okay? <laughs> yeah. Pouring my chef party, I got mini raviolis. Do you see it? Do you see it? Do you see it? Yeah, yeah. Okay. We're gonna glob it into this canister. I like that sound. Let's it's gather around the campfire and sing a campfire song. A C A M P F I R E S O N G song. No, if you don't sing it, no, you ruined it. Go to your tent. You sung it wrong. It's boiling. What was that? Wow. Dude, there could be a human being over there. You just threw a sword. It was a coyote. He threw a sword over there. It was a machete. Guys, we're actually in coyote country. There's, I actually see coyote poops up here. Actually, one pooped on my driveway. Yeah, I saw it. So we could literally be attacked. Oh, I forgot napkins. It's good to go, folks. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And we can just eat it right out of the can. Doesn't this sound satisfying? No, it's like nails on a chalkboard. Yeah, I was literally just about to say that. <laughs> Dude, you're the most disgusting eater I've ever heard. Hey Rob, let's Ow. go set up our tent. Our tent's already set up. Rob, I was gonna play a prank on Jeff, but you ruined it. Oh! Hey Chris, I can't really see my raviolis with your light flashing like that because it's dark in Flashing? Me. More like Is that better? Let me see. I need to be able to see my raviolis. Is that better? Mm. Is that better? It's a lot better. Hey Jeff, I we're gonna take this lantern because you don't need it because you have nothing in your tent to see. Go on in. Close it up. <laughs> Dude, it's so cold in here, I can see my breath. Well, I have a 10 degree sleeping bag, so it looks like I'm gonna be good. As long as no more spiders are on my cot, I'll be fine. So we're actually gonna go on an adventure tonight and uh, see what we can find around us. Because why would you go camping to see the inside of your tent? Unless it's this one, of course. Meanwhile. I just turn the light. Are you recording? Yeah. Why? Do something. We need more footage. I'm reviewing a video right now. Reviewing a video? What is that? Ah! What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Did I scare yeah. you? Yeah, you got him. I was like, why is Ryan turn the light on and then I just see this thing out of nowhere? <laughs> so we got this, these from the truck. We got a light for our tent. It's huge. Oh, dude, I can't believe you didn't hear me sneaking up on you. I heard, I heard running and then that's why I freaked out. <laughs> I can't risk it. All right, so let's put this light in the tent. Hold on, I want to make this tent a glow stick. Dude, that's bright. Dude, turn that around. You don't, you don't need that much light. Do this, and then it kind of creates a glowy effect. Well guys, uh, it ain't a dangy bro video without a fun adventure, is it? Nope. Are we going on an adventure? Let's go on an adventure. Okay. Let's see what we can find. Ah, <sighs> deep breath. <laughs> <laughs> Did you fuck it up so bad? <laughs> so we're going to go on an adventure now. And if we get lost, we can just see our glow tent. Oh yeah. So we're going this way? And I have this big blade for protection. You coming, Rob? Wait, where's my weapon? I'm your weapon. <laughs> <laughs> this way. We all have got our weapons. Guys, what if we find like a giant tarantula? They roam around these parts at night. Do you know that? Let's try and find one. Is that a fact or is that just some improv? No, they do. Look at this creepy butt. Dude, I'm oh! a wolf. 
There's legit something in there. Hello? It hasn't even been a minute. We got scared. Dude, Hello? leave it to the Dangy Bros getting scared in the wilderness at a little squirrel in a tree. Oh! Oh! What is that? I think it's a bird. I think it's a bird. It's the bird's sleeping. Let's not let's not bother the bird. All right, guys. This is Jeff versus Wild. Jeff, we're gonna find something. This is Jeff versus Wild version 15 because he does it every time. Why is it ah! cool? Jeff, don't do that. Oh, sorry. Dude, what if we find a mountain lion out here? We're just sketch. Dude, there's four of us. There's We're four of us. Rude. We'll be fine. We all got machetes. We are. I know. Dead meat. <laughs> uh, who cares about the camera, man? Can I hit it with the camera? Sure. We got this way. Looks like the only. Trail. I guess they all see the tent. Ah! I stepped in that poo. Oh, poo. I stepped on that tar. What is that dino poo? Dude, I stepped in it. <laughs> Dude, that's a big poo. That's a horse turd. Yeah, we should be careful. False alarm. It's the killer donkey. Dude, this is a ginormous dung pile right here. Another one. There's another turd Literally here. Literally another turd. Another one. Where's all these turds another coming one. from? Ryan! <laughs> Stop turning everywhere, <laughs> dude. Dude, I want to get out of here. There's too many poos everywhere. Can we go back to the tent? Afraid of poos? There's literally poo everywhere. Hey, Chris. Hmm. There's more poo. Oh my. The poo apocalypse. <laughs> Where's this poo coming from? It's the poo apocalypse. <laughs> everywhere. We're surrounded <laughs> by poo. I stepped in three poos already. Dude, I want to go back to my tent where there's no turds. Jeff, I'm gonna take a turd right on your tent just so you. I'm gonna take a turd on your tent. You can see the tent over there. Whoa! What is that? It's a bunny. Oh, it's just a bunny. You said it was a bunny. Oh. You said it was a bunny. Hey, look, it's a bunny. Oh, it's just a bunny. <laughs> yeah. Well, well, we're back from our adventure. That was poopy. My hands are freezing. Yeah, did you see the, the poopiest adventure you've ever had? Yeah, what a crappy adventure. I'm going into my tent and I'm going to my warm sleeping bag. It is freezing outside. So we're gonna go to sleep and then in the morning we're gonna let you know how comfortable the tents were. Guys, dental health is important in the apocalypse. Jeff, I sneezed on that toothbrush earlier. Can you hide? What? No? Ew. <laughs> well, I think I'm ready for bed. Yawny boys. Is that what we're called now? The yawn bros? Dude, <laughs> <laughs> oh rabies. What is this? That's my chair. How do you sit in that? With my butt. Like this? Whoa. Whoa. Now this put your feet out more. <laughs> you don't bounce <laughs> like that. <laughs> oh. oh. Find your balance zone. Like that? <laughs> your balance zone, <laughs> Chris. I'm falling over. I'm taking a pee over here. You're this not gonna put the lid sucks. back on the water? Dude, <laughs> that's my chair. Oh, shoot. <laughs> my favorite camp chair. <laughs> you literally yeeted it. Guys, I'm peeing. Bro, dude, what'd you do to this chair? This is, his, this is personal chair, you jerkwad. I'm headed mm. into my tent if you wanna follow me over so you can see me get in my tent. Unzippy zip, my tenty tent. I gotta make sure there's no buggies in here. What's up? I'm zipping up. Well, guys, I can't wait to get into my bed. I'm gonna take my pants off, so blur this out. Ah! Hey, Rob, that's my cot. This is my cot. I can't wait to go to sleep in my nice, comfy cot. Bro, that's my cot. No, that's my cot. That's my cot. No, my cot. No, my cot. No. My cot. No. What the heck are you guys doing? What? Rob, that's Chris's cot. <laughs> I'm trying to see if this has creepy collies all over it. Because it's been sitting in the garage. This sleeping bag is honestly so cozy. Alright, I'm all ready for bed. Going night night? Mm -hmm. Good night, Chris. Good night. Dude, I'm ready to be warm. I'm also gonna change, so. Should I leave? Yeah. Or should I keep filming? Dude, you can film all you want. <laughs> Might be a little weird. I'm gonna go crawl in my sleeping bag. See you, Ryan, see you, Ryan. See you in the morning. I brought my own nice comfy tent, so that way I could stay away from the snorers. Can't handle snoring. Mine's probably smaller than Jeffrey's, but I 
think it might be cooler. One hour later. I think too. Yeah. Rob, mm, Rob, the girls are pranking us, bro. Dude, it smells so bad in here. Bro. It smells literally so bad. What'd you guys do? I, it's what you guys did. Yeah, I don't know what you ate, but I didn't cook that. <laughs> right, what do we do? I'm cold, but I'm going out. You're going out? I couldn't regret this. <laughs> AC, mouse traps. Are you wearing shorts, Rob? Right? Alright guys, if you want to see the rest of this, you're going to have to go to the Danger Babes channel. <laughs> Link will be at the end of this video. The next day. Good morning, Ryan. Morning. <laughs> What the heck happened in here? Dude, the Dingy Babes pranked us. How would you sleep? Okay, up until about an hour or two ago when it got really cold. I have a 20 degree sleeping bag and a 10 degree <laughs> sleeping bag. <laughs> I was freezing. It wasn't enough? No, I was so cold. Halfway through, I put the 20 degree on. It was Rob's, I stole it. But he left because the Dingy Babes pranked him. Jeffrey left as well. So it's just me and Ryan here, but we made it. We're gonna rate the tents real quick. Ew. So I'd say that this tent for warmth, I'm gonna give it a zero out of 10. <laughs> if it had the heater, then maybe it would be good. I'm gonna say for space, I'm gonna give it a 10 out of 10 because I can stand up in here and you could probably fit a lot of people in here. And then I'm gonna say for looks, this tent's pretty cool. I'm gonna give it a eight out of 10. What would you say, Ryan? Yeah. Okay. For value, I'm gonna have to say a four out of 10 because it's definitely not worth a thousand dollars. No way. So yeah, that was my tent. Now go look at Jeffrey's. <laughs> oh my gosh. Dude, they spray painted it? Yeah, they spray painted it and he got wrecked with like water and flour. Dang. Jeffrey's tent was pretty basic. So, you know, space probably two out of 10. Warmth probably also zero out of 10. Value probably pretty decent actually. I would say nine out of 10, or should I say 10 out of 10? <laughs> well anyways, those are the tents guys. $10 tent versus $1,000 tent. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to check out the Danger Bays video. They pranked us right here. And then check out the video that's best for you right here. Click on the middle to subscribe. We'll see you next time.